Hey, uh, first of all, I'd like to apologise if I look a sad a bit rugby today. I'm um, just coming out the end of a really bad cold, so please bear with me. Um, so in my latest post, I'm discussing a pretty upsetting incident that has happened personally to me. I'm just really trying to figure out how incidents like that can be avoided in the future. Um, it's been quite hard to talk about, to be honest. Um, but I do think it's important that you know, we as anxiety sufferers do, you know, talk about our harder moments, the times when we have been stigmatised, um, really. So, um, imagine how difficult it must be for someone to look from the outside, no direct experience or understanding of anxiety. It is difficult enough being a sufferer to try and understand and explain it. Um, and it must be really hard if you don't have that personal understanding. Um, I can't be the only person out there who wishes that there was a magic telescope out there um, where somebody could look into my head and understand what I was thinking and understand me better, really. Um, but unfortunately, uh, life really isn't as simple as that. The best way that I have found to improve is to improve in communication. If you are lucky enough to feel you can confide in a friend, uh, by all means do, it's completely important that more people understand about anxiety so that they are better, you know, they're better equipped to deal with some of the more negative um, symptoms should they occur. If you know someone with anxiety, then do make a conscientious effort to read up on the condition. Um, there are some great resources out there, not just Healthy Place, many others as well. Um, many other publications most of all, do think twice before making your mind about somebody. None of us really know what's going on um, in the mind of another human being. And we shouldn't judge um, before we need to. So that's all I have to say today. And thank you very much for reading.